The dog went for his shots. I thought that was my opportunity to get out of my obligation that my nephew was in. Because if my sister would have called me, you know, I would have said, hell no. Keep your dog. Are you crazy? And she know I would say that. That's why she called Matt. And Matt says, okay. She said, don't tell David. So I don't find out till all these dogs show up at the house. I said, what's going on here? He said, oh, I'm supposed to keep the dog for a week or two and till he leave town. So, today my cousin came by, Sheila. Y'all know her mama, the one that took the picture, my auntie, that was in the video. She came by and picked the dogs up to take him to get some shots before he could travel to Atlanta, Georgia. So when she came back, David, you don't want to open your door? This is what I'm going to do. I'm going to leave this dog on your front porch. Oh, I was sleeping. I didn't hear you outside. She said, yeah, right. You heard me knocking. Hi, cousin. See, so you brought back the dog. She said, yes. So where's the cage at? I'd go get it. Hmm. I'd go do my gig tomorrow, and I gotta go to school. No dog cage. And you think this cute little dog don't do nothing. So. <clears throat> my sister called me up. The one that goes to church every Sunday and go to Bible study on Wednesday night. She said, do you know what Nehemiah did? Uh, she said, Nehemiah in the Bible. I said, what he did, honey? She said, he tore down the walls of Jerusalem. Got to go.